TMS is transcranial magnetic stimulation. It uses uh, a non-invasive way of stimulating the brain with magnetic waves generated out of a small machine. It's been done in uh, a few uh, locations, looking at kids with different disorders. We're the first group, uh, or, or one of a very short uh, list of people, to look at the mapping in stroke, and it's happened to a young person, usually around the time of birth. The big study we're doing here is we're randomly uh, taking a, we take a group of kids who had stroke around birth, there's a, a random chance that they'll be put in a group that gets either the RTMS or a pretend version. And they're also randomized again to get something called constraint therapy, which has a cast put on their good arm so that they're forced, in a sense, to use their, their uh, disabled arm. And so this, these young group of kids come through the study, they come for two weeks, they get very intensive therapy during those two weeks, and they're randomized to receive RTMS or constraint, both or neither. And that's the only way we'll figure out what's what's really working. That's what Alana's done, and, and she's part of a group of uh, six kids going through the program right now. So they were all measured, their, their function and their brain mapping was all done before they started this two-week camp. They're here right now halfway through their two-week camp, getting all sorts of creative types of uh, therapy all day, every day. And then we measure them again a week, and we follow them up to six months after the camp to get a look at their function, look at how their brain's changed. And my moving in the right room gotten a lot better. I can go up to 180 degrees without hurting until I do it for a long time and my arm doesn't get tired as fast. Before I can dribble a basketball, now I can dribble it like any other person. Now I can throw a tennis ball underhand and before I can just go overhand and I'd hardly hit the wall. The real purpose of the camp is that uh, these interventions are, we think are helping the brain learn better or sort of priming the brain for learning. What we hope is these interventions will let them learn better so that at the end they, they make even bigger gains uh, than they would have otherwise.